everybody, this is Bridget, and welcome to a new video that I'm doing. I am trying different health foods from REI, as you can see in the background. So today I have Iced Gingerbread Cliff Bar, a Honey Stinger Vanilla Waffle, GU Energy Gel, that is chocolate peanut butter, and then Boost Oat Bars. So this is all Bridget friendly, no dairy, no eggs, no tree nuts, and it's very healthy too. I think this one has non-GMO products. I'm excited about that. I really like honey, so I'm excited about this one. The energy gel, I'm only going to do a little bit of because it is 6.30 at night and I don't need to be up all night. So I'm only going to do about a tongue full and it says 5 minutes before every 45. Hydrate along the way. So I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to eat this whole tube or spread it onto jam. I'm not sure. It's 100 calories. I don't know. We'll see. So the first thing I'm going to try is the Cliff Bar. And it's ginger icing flavor. And I'm going to only take a bite of it. If I like it, I'll eat it later. Let's try this first. Oh yeah. Sippy sippy. Ah. <laughs> if anyone knows what that's from, please comment down below. Okay, crack it open. I can have this, right? Let me let me double check real quick. See, this is why I read it. Never mind, Bridget can't have this. It has pecans. Guess it's going to my mom. Good thing I double read it because I've had one of these before and it almost killed me. Let's go with the honey because I know I can have this because it's literally just wheat and soy and honey. So let's try this one. Maybe I'll have better luck. <laughs> See, I was just in the hospital last week. So, I don't want to end up there again today. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, the smell from this thing is delicious. Oh my god, it smells so good. It's literally a waffle. I was expecting like honeycomb. What? Okay, I'm going to try it. Oh, it's very crumbly. It tastes like a sugar cookie. Like, those knockoff sugar cookies. Oh my god. It tastes just like a sugar cookie. Apparently this is an energy food. Well, to me, it tastes like a sugar cookie. A very crumbly sugar cookie but it's pretty good on a 10 or on a 5 scale rating of would eat again 5 being would eat again I'd give it a 4 I would definitely say 4 it makes me thirsty though mm. I'm glad I have this okay so next we're gonna try Bobo's oat bar Ooh, focus there it is so wheat and vegan let me double check here Yes, okay. Just break off a little piece. It's a cool little texture. Again, very plain. It is the original flavor. It tastes like I just put oatmeal in my mouth, but it's cold. It tastes like cold oatmeal. I'm pretty sure that's all it is. It's good though. Five rating. We'll definitely eat this again. But last but not least, well, definitely least, the chocolate peanut butter energy gel. And I'm not sure how this is going to go, but we'll see. There were many different flavors of this and I didn't know what to get. So I was going to get the chocolate and they had a vanilla bean, but I wasn't sure about it because I thought it would be too vanilla-y. So, oh my God, it's literally like gel. Oh, I'm scared. It smells like chocolate peanut butter. Yeah. Okay, I was right to be worried. I think it's the green tea leaf that's given it that flavor. I'll try it again. I don't know what that is. I definitely taste the peanut. And after having the oats in there, I'm tasting the oats and the peanuts and the fighting. The chocolate, very subtle, not enough chocolate. 
Kind of glad I didn't get the just plain chocolate. I think it would be better spread on toast, honestly. I don't think you're supposed to eat this plain. Um, again, I'm not sure. It doesn't have instructions. It just says, here, eat it. <laughs> Pretty sure you're just supposed to eat the whole package and just down it and not taste it. But I would give this a one. Would not eat again unless, like, I'm stranded in the middle of nowhere and need to have energy for no reason. So, this is a... Duh. That was gross. Um, very, very small amount of peanut taste, but I, t I definitely tasted the peanut. And the chocolate, oh, uh oh, no, no. <laughs> that flavor was probably, God, how to describe it? A watered down chocolate. That's the best way to put it. It's definitely a peanut with watered down chocolate. So like if you've ever spilt water on your chocolate bar, but you still ate it, that's what it tastes like. Or like if you just drank a drink of water and you put chocolate in your mouth at the same time, that's what it tastes like. Like, not the melty kind of chocolate. That was gross. No. <laughs> they had, like, blueberry and pomegranate and salted watermelon. Who wants salted watermelon? Chocolate, vanilla bean, um, I think they had kiwi. I thought the one that sounded the grossest was that chocolate watermelon. Uh, and they had blackberry, too. They had, like, a mixture of berries also. But, uh, no, unless I'm stranded in the middle of nowhere. Now, it might be your guys' cup of tea, but not mine. So, I would definitely recommend the oat bar, though. This is really good. <laughs> I'm gonna eat some more of this. I just had dinner, though, so I'm not really that hungry. Well, thanks so much for joining me on this quick little video of me trying different foods from REI that I can have because everything else has tree nuts or death in it, like the Cliff Bar. Good thing I read that. Always gotta double read, even when I get home. Hope you all have a great night. Toodles!